Hi everyone, Ash from Smash London here with another 10 minute core workout. We're going to be working all sections of the core, the front, the sides and the lower back. We're going to be going for 10 minutes, there's going to be 5 exercises. You can rest whenever you want but we will continue to keep going so there's only 5 seconds between each move to get into the next one but if you need to rest absolutely go for it. If you aren't already warm, hit pause now, do a little 2-3 to three minute warm up if you're stuck for ideas, grab one of our warm up videos. Otherwise if you're ready, let's get started. Before we do that though, let's set our intention. How do we want to feel at the end of this workout? Set it? Amazing. Let's go for it, we're going to achieve it. So we're going to start off with a crunch and twist. I will demonstrate as we go through the first round and then once we do it second, third and for the final fourth time you're going to be expert. So 10 minute core workout starts now. So crunch and twist, we're going to come up and we twist so that opposite elbow goes to opposite knee. Keep it going. Deep breaths. Now don't put too much pressure on yourself if you can't come up as high as I am. Even if you're just coming up ever so slightly off the floor like this, you are still getting an amazing core workout. Good, keep it going. Okay, we're now going into our second exercise, which is a side plank. So, on your elbow, lift your hips and hold. If you need more support, you can take your top leg just in front of you, foot on the floor, but keep your hips lifted. If you want to make this harder, you can take your arm and your top leg up to the sky. Your choice. Hold it. Remember the most important thing here is to keep those hips up. Deep breaths. Fantastic, take it down. We are now going into some straight leg scissors. So keeping the legs nice and straight, you're gonna scissor the legs, crisscrossing them and taking them up and down. Now if you want to, you can just keep them straight out, preferably at a 45 degree angle. But if you want to engage as much of the abs as possible, take them up and down. By doing that, you're going to engage so much more of that front section of your core. Okay, we're now going to go into the other side of the plank. Let's go. What's the most important thing we need to remember here? Yes, lift the hips. Keep the hips up. Stay strong. And remember, if you need some more support, top leg just in front of you, but try not to let the hips twist. Stay so that your shoulders pointing up to the sky. You'll feel that in the side. It's amazing. Final exercise, our swimmers. So on your front, arms outstretched. We just take the feet up and the arms up like we're swimming. Great for the lower back. If this hurts or if it's causing any discomfort in the lower back, keep your feet down and just use your arms. Deep breaths. Perfect, okay, get ready. Round two, crunch and twist, let's go. Make sure we're twisting side to side. Good. You've got this. Keep the back nice and flat. Do you remember the next exercise? Side plank. Let's go. While you're here, just take a moment to think about that intention you set at the beginning. And if you didn't set one, maybe something's popped into your head since we started training. Keep those hips up. Focus on that intention. Remember the next exercise? Those scissors. Straight leg. Let's get into position. Get ready. 
Let's go, straight leg, all the way up, and back down. Woo. Nice straight legs. You got this. The lower you get to the floor, the more you can get the lower abs. Okay, second side for that plank. Let's go. You got this. Keep those hips up. You know if you want to make it harder, take that top leg and arm up. Keep that balance. But this is great. Your shoulders back. Do you remember the next one? Rest. Swimmers. Okay, get ready. Let's go. You got this. Try and point the toes if your feet are off the floor. So you engage more of the lower back. Almost there. Perfect. Okay, we are halfway. Well done, you're smashing it. Let's go. Crunch and twist. Make sure your abs are lifting you. Try not to have your hands underneath your head. So you're not tempted to wrench your neck up. <sighs> Try and keep your hands at your temples. <sighs> well done, let's go into that side. Plank. <sighs> okay, so I'm gonna give you another alternative here. If you wanna make it a bit harder, add some dips in. But completely up to you. Don't put any pressure on yourself. Whatever feels good today, just keep those hips up when we take it to the top of the move. We got this. Okay, lie down, straight legs, into those scissors, let's go. Have some water whenever you need some. Listen to your body. Nobody knows your body better than you do. Keep it going. Almost there. Into the other side for that side plank. With dips, if you want, your choice. Keep it going. Swimmers, big deep breath, get ready. We got this. Really important that we work our lower back. Whenever we do core work, don't neglect it. And if you haven't done our other 10 minute core workout, it exists, go find it. Maybe not today though. <laughs> Amazing work. Final round, are you ready? Crunch and twist. Let's go. This is your last round, guys. You've got this. Five very simple moves that can 
can feel challenging, but is engaging all of your core, the front, sides, and back. Okay, side plank. Let's go. Your choice, you can add the dips. You can add that raise if you can. If you need support, go for it. No pressure. Keep the hips up. Keep it going. You got this. Almost there. Right, let's go. Straight leg. Last time you're gonna do this. Keep the legs as straight as possible. You look amazing. Keep it going. Woo! Nice straight legs. Try not to touch the floor. Almost there. One more minute of work. Let's go to the other side for that plank. We are nearly finished. Hold it. Deep breaths. Focus on that intention. How did you want to feel at the end of this workout? Hopefully you're feeling like that is definitely going to be accomplished. But don't put any pressure on yourself. Make sure you're being kind in that head of yours. Okay, last 30 seconds. Are you ready? Woo, let's go. Keep it going. You got this. We are almost there. And rest. Oh, that's it. Well done, guys. Workout is finished. Amazing work. Hopefully, you're sweating. I am. But well done. Don't put any pressure on yourself. Well done for turning up today, giving it your best shot. If you want to do another workout, there are plenty of other workouts on our channel. Maybe you want some hit or some strength, but maybe this was all you needed today, or maybe this was tapped on to another workout that you did. So whatever you're doing today, thank you for showing up. Thanks for giving it your best. Don't forget to stretch and also maybe listen to a mindful minute on our channel and reconnect body and mind. A massive well done. See you soon. Thank you guys so, so much for watching our video. We hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then please share it with the world, talk about it. We love bringing you this content. Yeah, we're massive advocates of strengthening your mental health um, and your physical health. That's why we created Smash London. Um, so you can support us by liking, subscribing, sharing, and if you are in a position to, please donate to us as well so that we can continue to do this work and bring this content to you. Have Thank an amazing you. day.